Okay. What's going on, everybody? My name is MT, and welcome back to Nerd Herd, a show where I just talk about nerd stuff, and either you care about it, or you don't care. And for those of you out there that are still looking forward to DC Cinematic Universe movies after watching Batman v Martha Man and Killer Croc in the quest for BET, Shazam is a movie that is still happening, and it just got a new writer! I know, right? I, too, am surprised to hear that DC movies have writers. Apparently, they planned this shit out first. That is amazing. And just in case you have no idea who the hell Shazam is, the Shazam comics are kind of like a comic book episode of Catfish. Because people think that they're putting the moves on a handsome, grown adult man, but it turns out that it was just an immature boy pretending to be a handsome mature adult man the whole time. And that was a horrible description. <sighs> All right, look, an old man abducted a small boy named Billy and said, hey little boy, you want to do some adult things? Who are you? What is this? It'll only tingle for a little bit. <laughs> I don't think I like this. Mm, too late. And then the old man zapped him and made him tingle without his consent and gave Billy the power to turn into a magical adult named Shazam whenever Billy said the word Shazam. Yay. Another horrible description. Why do I do this? But anyway, Hold on to your butts, everybody, because it looks like Shazam is going to be written by none other than Henry Gaiden. Who is Henry Gaiden, you ask? <laughs> um, have you not seen the cinematic masterpiece that is Earth to Icho? Because I haven't, but apparently he wrote it. Look at that rotten tomato. Wow, that is... That's so good. <laughs> Look, I'm sure Henry Gaiden is a really nice guy who has written some pretty decent stuff in the past, but in a world that desperately needs a DC movie that is, at the very least, okay, getting the guy who wrote an almost mediocre kids movie does not make me feel good about the future of Shazam. But speaking of the future of Shazam, Black Adam is apparently getting his own movie because DC is obsessed with bad guys apparently. Oh, okay, so why it gotta be Black Adam, MT? Why do Black Adam gotta be the bad guy, huh? How come no one's talking about White Adam, huh? I bet White Adam do bad things too, but no one say nothing because White Adam got rich parents. Hey, what Oh, okay, calm down. It's not a race thing because Black Adam is going to be played by Dwayne The Rock Johnson. And who knows what the hell that guy's race is. Like, I don't even think that guy's a human. Like, I'm pretty sure he was hatched from a rock. Which would make sense because that man is chiseled. Chiseled! But anyways, Black Adam is Shazam's magical arch nemesis who is also not exactly the greatest guy in the world, so it seems kind of weird that he's getting his own movie, but it does make sense given that DC is all about making bad guys into the good guys of movies these days, so... Whatever. I mean, I'll see it when it comes out, but I'm not exactly excited about it because, frankly, Suicide Squad got me fucked up. They got me fucked up for real, but... I'll see it. Why not? I mean, what else am I gonna do on a Friday night anyway? Do I do I look like a guy who has friends? <laughs> no. Comic books are my friends. You see this? Comic book. Comic book. Comic book. Look at it. I got more comic books. Look at this shit. The thing. He's about to punch the Dr. Doom. And speaking of Suicide Squad, director David Ayer took to Twitter recently to admit that he fucked up with Suicide Squad and that he wishes he had a time machine because he should have made the Joker the movie's main villain. To which the entirety of the internet replied in unison, no shit, David, you stupid mother... Okay, I'm sorry if it seems like I made this video into a DC Cinematic Universe bashing session. I mean, if you like Batman v Superman, or if you like Suicide Squad, that's fine. Like what you like, because at the end of the day, none of this shit really matters. But I personally am a little frustrated with Suicide Squad. But hey, to make it up to you guys, look, somebody bad did a bad thing and leaked a possible picture of a resurrected black suit Superman. Wow. Just look at him in his black suit glory. And hey, if you like black suits, why don't you just go to a funeral? Lots of black suits there. Black suits and tears. Lots of those things. I don't know why I said that. Wow. That was really morbid. If you like black suits, you don't have to go to a funeral to see a black suit. Just go see Black Panther in February of next year. <sighs>
I'm gonna need David Ayer to let me borrow his regret time machine because I am not waiting that long to see Black Panther. Like, that movie's going to be the shit. The shit. The shit. But to hold us over until then, we got some Black Panther set photos, son. And good news, everyone. Black people confirmed. There will be actual black people portraying black people in Black Panther. Wow, the future is now. Black person, black person, black person, black person. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. Martin Freeman? Is Martin Freeman black person? Nope, but it does look like Everett Ross from Civil War will have a presence in Black Panther, which is extremely fitting, seeing as Everett Ross did play a significant role in Black Panther's life in the comics as a sort of ambassador between Wakanda and America. Yeah. Black people and white people getting together. Only in the comic books, everybody. <laughs> and to wrap this video up, hey, we got a new Black Panther logo because the old logo used to look like this, but now it looks like this. Wow, look at that African ass font. I feel like I'm in Africa right now just looking at it. Wow, it's so hot. And what, is that a cheetah? Wow, my stomach's growling. <laughs> Oh man, this video is not okay. I fucked up. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you haven't subscribed yet, do it or just leave a thumbs up or share this video. That also makes me happy on the inside. My name is MT and you just heard a word from a nerd. Catch you guys later. Comic books are my friends. You see this? Comic book, comic book, comic book. Look at it, I got more comic books. Look at this shit. The thing, he's about to punch the Dr. Doom. Look at this, fucking Time Walker. Look at this shit. Look at, freaking, remember that movie Star Kid? I got a comic book about that. Look at this, literally comic, Harbinger words. Har I got comic books, look at this. 18 days, I'm, I've never even read this comic. I didn't even know I had this comic. What is this? It's a man in a dress, and his dress is on fire. He's got a glove. Comic books, look at this. More Ivar Time Walker, great book. Another Ivar Time Walker, he's got a gun. Comic books. <laughs> I dropped all my comic books. <laughs> no. <laughs>